What's going on everybody, it's your boy Big Mike and I'm back with another video. Today we're going to be continuing the series where I give a random WWE Superstar every single current championship here on WWE 2K24. And we are going to see if they can hold either every title or a certain title going up to WrestleMania. So with that being said, let's get this video going. Alright, so in today's episode, we are going to be going with CM Punk. The ECW pack officially came out yesterday as CM Punk, the Dudley Boys, uh, Terry Funk, and Sandman. So we are going to be going with uh, CM Punk. I've already given all of them. Uh, I've given him all of the titles. So let's see if he is competing on Raw. And it actually is. He is going to be facing uh, Damian Priest for the World Heavyweight uh, Championship. So, I wonder, I don't think it's a cash-in. It doesn't say that it's a cash-in, but let's see who wins. And CM Punk retains uh, the World Heavyweight Championship in his first title defense. So, going over to NXT, he is not competing on NXT, so we will just sim over to SmackDown. Uh, he's in a triple threat match with Santos Escobar and Bobby Lashley. Um, doesn't look like he is in any other matches, so we'll just move over to Backlash. Um, let's see if he's defending one of the world titles. He is. He's going to be facing Seth Rollins, uh, for the World Heavyweight Championship. So, we will sim over to that match. And then, let's see if he can retain. He does not. Seth freaking Rollins is the new World Heavyweight Champion. Alright, so just like uh, Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins, CM Punk lost the World Heavyweight Championship at Backlash. So, so far, all three superstars that we have used have lost their first title, uh, either by the time we get to Backlash or at Backlash. So, uh, CM Punk no longer the world title, uh, no longer has the world title. He is facing Jinder Mahal on Raw. Um, no championship on the line, so we're just going to send over to NXT. He's going to be facing Elijah Dragunov, um, just the same as Rog and Shinder. No title on the line, so we'll move over to SmackDown. Uh, he's going to be facing Big E. No championship on the line, so we'll move over. Uh, we got Night of Champions coming up. Uh, he is facing Jey Uso. Seth Rollins is defending the world title against Cody Rhodes. Uh, Cody Rhodes won the world title. Damian Priest cashed in, uh, Money in the Bank. So it didn't work out for Seth or Damian Priest. Um, NXT, let's see, CM Punk not making an appearance on NXT. So we'll move over to Friday Night SmackDown. Um, let's see if he is appearing. He is not. So, two shows in a row for NXT and SmackDown. He hasn't appeared. He's defending the United States title against, uh, J.D. McDonough. Um, that looks like it is the only match he is in. Um, so let's send him over and let's see if he retains. He does not. J.D. McDonough is the new United States Champion. Alright, so CM Punk uh, lost the United States title. So he still has the Undisputed Championship, the United States... Not the United States. He's got the Undisputed title, Intercontinental title, and he still has the NXT Championship and the NXT North American Championship. He is facing Drew McIntyre, who he currently is in a rivalry with. Oh my god, when he recovers CM Punk and Drew McIntyre, that's going to be uh, an amazing match. Um, he is not appearing in any other matches after that. So let's see if he is on NXT, and he is not. 
uh, two weeks in a row. He has not made an appearance on NXT. Uh, he's facing Randy Orton on SmackDown, but no title on the line. All right, let's go over to NXT Battleground. Let's see if he's going to defend. He's defending the NXT Championship uh, against Baron Corbin, and that is the only match that he is in. So, can CM Punk retain the NXT title? He can. All right, so he retained the NXT Championship um, against Baron Corbin. So let's go ahead and we will sim past the rest of the show and let's move over to Raw, see if he is in a match here. And he is, he's facing Apollo Crews and he actually got the win. So let's move over to NXT. Um, he's not making an appearance on NXT. That is now three weeks in a row. He hasn't been on NXT um, he's gonna be facing Big E, this is the, I believe, the second time, uh, that he's faced, uh, Big E Langston. Um, Monday Night Raw, he is facing Drew McIntyre in the main event, and Drew McIntyre got the win there. Um, he's in a tag match on NXT, so for the first time in three shows for NXT, he is appearing... Uh, gonna team up with uh, Tyler Bate, um, not making another appearance on the show, no titles on the line. Um, he's facing Biggie again, so I'm wondering if there's gonna be a title match between him and Biggie for either the Intercontinental title or the uh, um, Undisputed Championship. Uh, he is not appearing on Raw. That is a first in a while now. Um, making his second appearance on NXT in a row. And he's in another tag match with Joey Gacy this time. Um, so we'll go ahead. And they actually won that tag match. Um, going over to SmackDown. He is going to be facing Bray Wyatt. Uh, no championship on the line, so we'll keep it going. We got NXT Gold Rush uh, coming up this week, so we'll see if he's defending a title there. He's facing Drew McIntyre again, and Drew McIntyre again uh, got the win. He's in another tag match on NXT, so I believe this is now three weeks in a row where he's been on NXT, and he is in a, uh, a tag team match, so... Uh, SmackDown, he'll be facing AJ Styles, uh, in the opening match. No other appearance there. Alright, let's move over to Gold Rush. Let's see which title he will defend if he is appearing on the show. He is. He's going to be defending the NXT Championship against Elijah Dragunov. So, let's see if he can, uh, retain the NXT Championship. And he can, so he is still uh, the NXT champion. So the only titles that he has not defended yet are the North American Championship, um, the Intercontinental Championship, and the uh, Undisputed Championship. We do have Money in the Bank coming up, so we'll see if he defends one of those titles. He is facing uh, MVP, and he did get the win. Uh, NXT, is he in another tag match? He's not. He's in a single match, uh, against Wolfgang. And Tiffany Stratton won the, uh, women's NXT championship. So, congratulations to, uh, Tiffany Stratton. Uh, looking at SmackDown. He is defending the undisputed championship on SmackDown against LA Knight. So, uh... Let's see if he retains, if he loses, and he retained the Undisputed Championship. So, let's go ahead. We'll move over to Money in the Bank in the hopes that he is defending his title. This is the men's uh, Money in the Bank ladder match. And CM Punk is defending the Intercontinental Championship against Drew McIntyre. 
I find it weird that they don't have, there's not a women's money in the bank ladder match. Um, but we're going to sim over to this intercontinental title match. And then we'll see who won that men's money in the bank ladder match. So uh, CM Punk retained the intercontinental championship. So, so far he's, he's making a comeback with title defenses. Uh, Kofi Kingston won the uh, money in the bank ladder match so congrats to uh kofi kingston uh let's see cm punk is defending the intercontinental championship in back-to-back -back nights not back-to-back -back nights because that money in the bank match was on a saturday but uh you guys know what i mean he's he's defending the intercontinental title in uh back-to-back -back shows so is miz gonna win the title is punk gonna retain and The Miz is the new Intercontinental Champion. Alright, so CM Punk is officially down to three championships. He has the NXT title, the North American title, and the Undisputed uh, Championship. Um, we do have Great American Bash for NXT coming up. Let's see if he is appearing. He's defending the NXT title against Elijah uh, Dragunov. So, he defended the Intercontinental title back-to-back. -back, went from Saturday to Monday. And now Tuesday, he is defending um, the NXT championship. So, let's see if he retains. And he does not. Elijah Dragunov is the new... NXT champion. Alright, so CM Punk went from successfully defending the Intercontinental Championship on Saturday to losing the Intercontinental Championship on Monday, and then he lost the NXT Championship on Tuesday. So in back to back nights, he was not able to successfully defend his title. So we are down. To the NXT North American Championship and the Undisputed uh, Championship. So let's see if he is competing on SmackDown. He is. He's facing Roman Reigns. And Roman Reigns got the win. All right, NXT Great American Bash. He's defending the North American Championship uh, in a triple threat match. So And it's the opening match. So let's see if uh, he can retain his title. And he can, so CM Punk is still um, the NXT North American Champion. So let's go ahead, uh, we'll just sim this last match, and then let's move over to Monday Night Raw. Let's see if he is appearing on the show, and he is not, but Jey Uso is the, f I don't think Jey Uso is the world champion, I, I don't know who... Kofi Kingston cashed in Money in the Bank and became the new World Heavyweight Champion. So, congratulations to uh, Kofi Kingston. Uh, Puck not making an appearance on NXT, so we'll move over to SmackDown. Um, he is, and he's going to be facing Roman Reigns again. And Roman Reigns, for the second week in a row, beat CM Punk. So, I'm wondering if that's going to be... Um, a new rivalry. Uh, he is facing Kevin Owens on Raw. Uh, Dirty Dom got the win against Gunther. That's, uh, that's a surprise. But we are simming the shows. So, um, it's not really a surprise there. Punk is defending the North American Championship, uh, against Noam Dar. So, this is two shows in a row on NXT where Punk is defending... Um, his title, uh, on the last show, on the last NXT show, he lost the NXT title to Dragunov, so let's see if he can retain the North American Championship, and he cannot, Noam Dar is the new NXT North American Champion. All right, so CM Punk only has one championship left, and that is the Undisputed uh, Championship. So we're just going to move on here. He is facing Roman Reigns for the third week in a row. And for the third week in a row, uh, Roman Reigns got the win against uh, CM Punk. We do have SummerSlam coming up. He is appearing on Raw in a Fatal 4-Way match. 
Um, he is not defending the championship. I'm wondering if he's going to defend that uh, undisputed title against Roman at um, SummerSlam. No appearance on NXT. Uh, let's see what's going on with SmackDown. Watch him face Roman Reigns again. Yep. Uh, fourth week in a row. Or fourth SmackDown in a row. And Roman Reigns is 4-0 against uh cm punk i assume roman reigns is gonna get that title shot here at uh SummerSlam. um and yep i assume correctly so uh roman is 4-0 um against cm punk so i i don't know uh if cm punk is gonna retain um his uh undisputed championship but we'll sim over to the match all right, we're going to sim the match and see if he can retain. He does not. Roman Reigns is officially the new undisputed champion. All right, so unfortunately, CM Punk has officially lost every single championship that we gave to him. Um, wasn't a great showing for him. He did have a couple good title defenses, uh, was able to retain his titles here and there. Uh, obviously lost the Intercontinental title to The Miz on Raw, and then the very next night on NXT on Tuesday, lost the NXT Championship, um, to Elijah Dragunov. But he had an alright one, did get his ass kicked by Roman Reigns, uh, five times in a row, and that fifth match being for... Um, the Undisputed Championship. So, yeah. Uh, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like. Comment down below what other videos you guys would like to see. And other than that, I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.